okay welcome back to another youtube video it's been a minute since i've done one of these but uh, i am going to show you how to utilize tiktok live studio with the with obs using a plugin called atom vertical hold on i already messed it up atom atom uh just atom vertical plugin and how you can get that is you're gonna go to this website i'm gonna link all the websites in the description where you have to go to download these products so what you want to do is you want to go to the atom.tv forward slash product forward slash vertical and you gotta download this for your obs now it only works on obs studios 29 plus so you gotta make sure uh obs is updated to you know to the recent uh one I know it's, I think it's 30, it's out right now, but <laughs> you're gonna download that product onto your OBS. You gotta close OBS, download that, then reopen OBS. And you should, you're gonna see multiple me right now. You should get a screen like this. You're gonna get another um, window for the vertical plugin. And then you're gonna get some scenes and some sources. Now mine's already customized to how I want it. So this is how I have it, but I don't I don't mess with any of the settings right here where it shows um, like for streaming and all that and recording. I don't mess with any of that. I could, but I don't want to. And it's just uh, use your preference. So now I have that set up and you're, you're going to want to go to TikTok.com forward slash studio forward slash download so you can download the TikTok live studio application on Windows. Now. I think if in order to get a stream key, you have to reach a certain amount of followers. I was uh, blessed enough to be put into an agency that gives me a stream key. So whoever you know, whoever can give you a stream key, you know, hit them up so you can try to get go live. So so that you can go live on mobile. And um, once you have all that, uh, you can also download the live studio application. And when you download it, set everything up and sign in, this is what it's gonna look like. You're gonna have nothing, right? You have nothing and most likely the scenes is gonna be in portrait mode. So now on how you wanna do it is over here on OBS studios, where you're, what you're gonna wanna do is right here on the vertical side, see the little thing where I highlighted? That's the uh, vertical virtual camera. If you hover over it, it's gonna pop up. When you click on that, it's to show this right here to stop virtual camera. So you have your virtual camera set up. So that you have that set it does. So now you go back to TikTok Live Studio. You're gonna add source. Click it, and you're gonna want to click on. Oh yeah, you want to click on camera, not game catcher camera. You're gonna hit add. And now you're gonna want to go down here where it shows camera. And now you want to go to where it says OBS virtual camera. Have that. Let's see. Okay, I had a flip. Okay, it was looking weird on my end. I'm like, wait, that's not how it looks like on my OBS. It was flipped for some reason. So now we answer all that. You have your resolution all set, the FPS and everything. I, I just leave everything the same because it's just mirroring my OBS virtual camera. I'm like, all right, cool. I'm all good. And then hit add source. And then you're gonna want to right click. You wanna right click on it if, or you can also drag it along this way. But see, we're, we're a little bit smarter. Why is it flipped? I don't know why it's doing that. So we're gonna go here, fit the screen, boom. And obviously we're gonna go to settings because I don't know why it didn't flip earlier. There we go. Now it's looking all, looking all perfect, all clear. So now you have that all set up uh, for the vertical side. Okay, so um, I was having some issues with the um, with my encoding process on showing you guys landscape mode. But if you want to do the same thing with landscape, like how you do with portrait, you're going to just add the virtual camera 
and then you're going to want to tweak with the settings so you switch the resolution to 1920 by 1080 and it should you know stay the same um with me my um my computer is a little bit outdated i have a amd ryzen 7 3700x with a nvidia geforce rtx 2080 super so it's a little outdated i could do better so but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed the uh, video on how to try to utilize uh, tiktok live studio from your obs so obviously you really don't have to tweak with too much settings because you know i have you know this enable a preview I, you know i really don't have to in it well i don't i don't really have want to have a preview up right here so i just disable preview and i make sure this little check box right here is marked to the virtual camera so it picks up from my live studio and then you want to just uh tweak with your audio settings on here on tiktok live studio so you want to make sure you put your microphone and the game for when you're gonna be gaming and all that and then you can also add see where we are gonna add got alerts source so yeah I hope you guys enjoy this video I'm gonna go and get going and uh edit this out so i hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day make sure y'all drink a lot of water stay blessed and i'll put all the links to everything you need to download in the description below so i will catch you guys in the next youtube video all right peace